Okay, today I'm out here with Hard Course. I'm your Huckleberry, call named Finn. Finn is a 12 week old puppy. He's been with us since he was about seven weeks old. And over the next several months, we're gonna chronicle Finn's training pretty much from start to finish. Now, today we're gonna talk about the two main things that we wanna work on with a puppy at this age. People ask me all the time, when do you start training? Well, generally we started at about 10 weeks old when the dog is old enough to recognize its name. Um, in this case, Finn started recognizing his name about two weeks ago, and the first thing that we teach is basic obedience and good citizenship, but at the same time, we also want to develop that dog's desire to retrieve and make sure that he's a really happy, well-socialized puppy. Now, in the beginning with our basic obedience, it's about citizenship, teaching the dog parameters, what no means, and that when you walk on the leash, the dog has to walk with you, not walk you along. And so our first obedience command that we teach isn't sit, it's heal. We're gonna keep these sessions really, really short. Yes, sir, buddy. And let him walk on leash. He's gonna try me a little. He's not fighting the leash anymore, but you'll see that we, we're trying to teach him that, hey, we're in control and we walk the dog. The dog doesn't walk us. Good boy. Okay, heal. No, heal. Good, I used that no command just then to bring him under control. Good. Good boy, Good. 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 Good boy. Good. We're going to take a couple of turns around the yard. Good boy. No. Here. Heel. You see him start to walk away. We're bringing him back under control. Good. Good boy. Good. We're giving a lot of praise. We're trying to really keep this happy and make it fun. And we're going to keep these sessions really short, two or three times a day. Get him out, walk around the yard a little bit. We're also now starting to teach sit, sit. Good. I pulled up on the leash, put a little pressure on him. He's learning if he complies with that command and sits down, he can turn that pressure off. So, just basic obedience stuff right now. Heel and sit. And then, even more importantly at the same time, we want to work really, really hard on developing his desire to retreat. So, I've got my hardcore puppy bumper here. Probably gonna graduate to a bigger bumper in the next couple of days. We've also been working with a teal, small duck. And we're gonna keep the leash on him where if he wants to run off, I don't have to chase him down. I just go to the end of the leash. We wanna make this dog crazy about retrieving. So this is gonna be a lot of fun. Keep it happy, encourage him to hunt. If he fails, no big deal. Just tease him with it some more. Good boy, hey, 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 hey. Oh, you want this? You want this? Hey, hey, hey. Good man, as you can see, he's going after it like crazy. Good boy, Finn. Good. Good boy, all right. All right, he wants to run off with it a little bit. I didn't go chase the dog. I just stepped on the end of my leash. Hey, hey, hey. Good, hey. Put you up, buddy. Good. He missed that one, no big deal. Come on, let's go. Good boy. Good boy. Good man, buddy. Come on, you want one more? Again, we're going to keep this really, really short and just make it a lot of fun for him. Good. We're teaching him to watch that bird and really want to go for it. Good boy. All right. All right. Good job. So in the beginning, good citizenship. Make him crazy about wanting to retreat. Good man, buddy. Come here. Come here, yeah. Yeah, that's my boy, you did a good job. Yes, you did. All right. 